Hello, my name is Tiffany. I'm an Avon representative. I'm here today to show you some of the um, Avon tools that I use for, you know, helping with makeup application, things like that. So today I would like to show you um, one of the items I use is my tweezer. Now I cannot find my older tweezer that I used to use because I wanted to show you the difference on what they look like, you know, the normal thin one piece one very difficult for me so when I found this in the way you can hold it is just amazing it's really amazing and it makes it very easy close to get into um, so I would definitely recommend getting one of these and it's very you know to me it's just very useful in gripping and things like that um, whereas my old one very simple, kind of hard, and this one really grips. I don't know if you can see the edges there. Really grips. With my other one, it was just like the corners were kind of like to touch to pull hairs. I don't like that. I like to really get the hairs. As you can see, I have very thick eyebrows, so definitely need support. <laughs> so my second item that I got from Avon is an um, eyelash curl. It's very lightweight and similar to every single one. Doesn't have a specific curve or anything. So what I really love about this is compared to my lacrosse one I have, it's heavier and it seems that I feel like this hurts my lashes compared to this. It's like I'm not even putting anything you know any pressure or anything on it it just seems like it's effortless but with this one it feels like my eyelashes ache I don't know if you guys understand that um, or have ever felt that it just feels like your lashes just the um, where your lashes grow just feel achy for some reason um, and I've been trying to look for a really good one and um, you know something that I don't feel but it's still doing its job so yeah really liking this right now really loving it um, and I just keep this one as a backup just in case anything happens to my lovely lightweight one um, looks like I would reorder it but of course until it, I get it I would use my backup now my next item um you know disposables but I tell you what, these work really well, makeup applications, better than my non-brand type ones. I say non-brand, but it's more of like, you know when you buy a, a, a shadow packet or something, it just comes with it. So it's not necessarily as non-brand, it's just some random brand or it can be with one of the high-end makeup companies. Um, but it feels like this, these disposable ones, even though they're disposable, when I clean them, they're great to con for continued use. And these are really awesome as well for um, if you're doing a show for your customers, um, for you Avon reps out there. Um, these are really good since they're disposable. Um, they're not expensive. You can get a pack of, I think they came in a pack of five to eight. Um, and you now each customer, you know, if you happen to have a display for them to try out, you can just put these out there and they'll be really be able to use them. They got a pink side and you got a black side. So that really speaks to me. I love it. Now, another brush that I have is a brow brush, you know, with a little spoolie. Very nice, very soft. I love it on the other end as it's um you know the bristles brush part whatever which I, I really don't use these for my eyebrows I just use a spoolie what I really use this for is for my um how do you say my lashes so you can probably see there's a little bit of product on there but I really use this for my lashes really um to separate them and make sure they're okay whatever but the spoolie part I do use for um my brows <laughs> So, compared to my old spoolie, I really love this. 
and I love how they're dual ended. It's really nice. Now this one I haven't used yet, but it's my eyeliner brush. I think it's really nice. Tapered it. I'm sorry if you can't really see the other side. So I haven't really used it because I haven't really got any um, cream eyeliners. Um, every now and then, if I want to use a, um, how do you say, an eyeshadow as a liner, I would definitely use this. But right now, um, I haven't really wanted to do that with my eyeshadows. And also, at, like I said, I haven't bought any um, cream or the um, pop eyeliners that I would want to use this with. But I'm, again, glad it's dual-ended, and I'm glad that it's very soft, like the other brushes, and it's good. Um, now, another brush that I have is the crease brush, which I have used. I've never had a crease brush, and it just came with my packet, so I was like, um, when I, you know, ordered a bundle of something, it was one of the brushes, and I just thought it was really nice. It's very soft. And it does work really well for your crease. Now, those are the only items so far that I've bought from um, Avon. Now, it's okay to like other products because I know a lot of people say, well, you Avon ladies or you different company ladies, you don't like to use anybody else. That's not true. I love my Real Technique brushes. But let me tell you, these have been very great. And I'm thinking about buying the other brushes because, you know, for my Real Technique, Real Technique brushes I have, you know, the blush brush, the um, stippling brush. So I would love to try out Yvonne's brushes and see how that compares. So that is all, gals. That is all I have for today. Um, just wanted to show you that, you know, Avon does have really great brushes. And they have different things that you can use. And I'm just two comparisons to things that I already have. Um... There is nothing wrong with using other brushes. Like I said, I love a different brand of brushes as well. So my Real Technique brushes, I will not get rid of them unless I have to. Because um, I love them. And I definitely love my um, Avon brushes that I have. And I will be buying more. Um, definitely once I get them, I'll show you guys. Um, I'm sure once I start doing tutorials, you'll see me using these brushes and how they work. But I just wanted to show you guys what they look like and... Uh, my opinion of how they feel and what I use them for. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And also, you know, I use, um, I haven't used yet, but you know, I've just recently got a beauty, um, what do you call it, a beauty sponge or beauty blenders. Um, you know, different companies, nothing wrong with that. So I don't think this is like always Avon, you know, kind of thing. I love other things. There's nothing wrong with having other things, but mainly because I'm an Avon rep, that's the products you, you're going to see. And every now and then I may do a look where I have other products on. I will mention it because I know a lot of people like things and they want to know what it is. Um, but as of right now, that's all I have for you guys and gals. Um, just leave any questions you may have or any concerns you may have about certain brushes or um, another thing I know a lot of people ask about is um, whether the bristles fall off and things like that I haven't had the problem with my um, my spoolie brush I've never had that problem it's still in good condition I've had it for months um, as far as my crease brush that has not happened at all I don't see anything plucking out going crazy things like that I've had it for months like I said um, and, I mean, as far as my other brushes, they're pretty sturdy, and I like it. Um, so, if you guys want any of these brushes, um, you can go to www.youravoncom slash tharden. I'll leave it down in the description bar on my website. And give me a thumb up. And, of course, subscribe if you like me. Um, but, no, you don't have to if you don't want to. Um, I am new, so... Bear with me in my videos. <laughs> um, but thank you for taking the time to watch my videos. And if you have any questions or any concerns, or if you want to know if we have a certain product, definitely message me below. I will definitely comment back to you. And you guys have a great day. Bye.